Microsoft's Windows Phone 7 devices launched this week in the US. If you just picked one up, here are some tips and tricks to get you started. If you took a wait and see approach and you're watching this video several years into the future, greetings from beyond the grave. We'll start out with a very simple first trick. Just hold down any tile on your uh, main home screen here and you can move it around and change it with other tiles. Uh, even remove it from your home screen. And if you want to add a tile from your list of programs to the home screen, just hold it down and click pin to start and then you can position it where you like, and there it is. Another handy trick is voice control. You can hold down the Windows button and then open programs. Open Marketplace. Starting Marketplace. And you can also use the voice activation to perform web searches. Find kittens inspired by kittens. Searching for kittens inspired by kittens. The web browser defaults to mobile versions of uh, websites. So, for instance, Techland here is uh, mostly links, but if we want to see Techland in all its glory, we can go into uh, Settings, and then under Applications, Internet Explorer will choose the desktop version for our website preferences. And then any sites you pull up in the future, you'll get the full version, not the mobile version. So you can also use these three little buttons here to pin a website to your Start menu. So any favorite sites you have will be readily available uh, when you want to access them quickly. Um, you can also use the Find feature to search for uh, particular instances of words within uh, a website. And finally, the best feature, in my opinion, is the ability to locate your phone if you've lost it or even lock it remotely. And you can do that all via the web-based interface. That's just the tip of the iceberg. Check out techland.com for more tips, tricks, and Windows Phone 7 coverage. Or if it is several years into the future, check around heaven for Doug. If I'm in hell, frankly, I'm going to be very surprised. Yes, I stole a pack of Rolos once when I was on spring break and inebriated, but I did buy a second package of Rolos, so it's not like I just stole it. I bought one, and I pocketed another. Man, shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have done that.